A Minnesota woman was all set to attend a relative's wedding when her babysitter canceled at the last minute. So Jessica Baker and her husband didn't attend the wedding because kids weren't invited. A couple weeks later, they received a bill for $75.90 in the mail to cover the meals they would have eaten at the reception. You gotta be kidding me. I guess I don't know what the right answer would have been, what the right thing to do would have been. Viewers on CARE's Facebook page had plenty to say about the situation. One person wrote, as a planner of many events, having no-shows is part of the process. This situation should have been considered long before the wedding took place. Another suggested Jessica should make a donation in the bride and groom's name instead of giving the money to the newly married couple. It's not being reported whether Jessica let the bride and groom know she and her husband wouldn't be able to attend the wedding. But a writer for The Knot does say instead of just not showing up, guests who RSVP'd yes should let the host know they can't make it to the event. A wedding planner was a little more direct when she wrote an op-ed for the Huffington Post saying, unless you're in the hospital or have just had a death in your immediate family, there is no excuse to no-show at a wedding. Ever. It's very rude. We're guessing Jessica and her husband aren't planning to pay the bill, though. Care reports they actually threw it away after receiving it. For Newsy, I'm Katherine Beek.